what is up guys welcome back to the channel and in today's video we are going to be continuing our playlist on react navigation and today we are going to learn how we can pass params through our navigation okay so for instance if what we have here this is what we did initially right and we have this home screen here where when you click the details button it routes you to the details screen okay and when you click on the home button it routes you back to the home screen so basically it's simply routing to these two different screens right but what we want to do now is we want to pass in some parameters right we want to pass in some params that when we go to the details screen we are we are going to see it appear on the details screen we're going to have it being transported from the uh, the home screen to the detail screen so basically that's what i'm going to do in today's video if that sounds interesting do you want to hit the like button and if you are new to this channel subscribe to the channel as well to grow the the channel and leave your comment your thoughts in the comment section as well okay let's get into the video and start coding okay so this is our detail screen right this is our detail screen and but let's move to the home screen okay let's move to the home screen and this is the line where when you click on the button it navigates to the detail screen so right now on our simulator here we are on the home screen okay so what we want to do now is to pass in some parameters that when we move to the or when we navigate to the detail screen you want to have it on the detail screen okay so on the on press event here we are saying navigation or navigate to the detail screen now the next thing we want to do is to bring these parameters here all right so to add the parameters, this is basically what you want to do. Bring in a comma and then add a curly braces. And then it's going to be in an object form. So you put in the values you, you want to add. So I'm going to say name, right? So name, and I'm going to put in the name there. So Kelvin Soa. And then I'm going to say H. And let me say 21. So basically, this is the details you want to navigate. You want to have been navigated from the home screen to the detail screen. Okay, so because we want to have the details of the user on the detail screen, basically, that's the whole idea here. Okay, so now that we have this navigation with this curly braces with the params here, we can now move to the detail screen here and then grab them. Okay, to grab this, um, this params, I'm going to add a new prop. So beside the navigation, I'm going to say routes. Okay, I'm going to say routes now. This route. Is where we are going to get our params from so we are saying const name and then age equals route dot params now as using name and age here because that's what we named it in here so we are using name and then age here so if you want to use these values then it means we have to use the exact same names the, the exact same keys we used in the home screen if you use a different thing it's not going to work so make sure you are using the same the same values here so i'm saying const name age equals routes.param so here we are getting the values from the home screen on the detail screen now what we can do here is now add a text here say name where we are going to get the value of name and we're also going to add another text say age we are going to get the value of age so right now if we route from the home screen to the detail screen we should not only see this this is your details we should only see name with the value of name here where we are getting the name from the home screen and then we should also get the age and then the value of age here, which we are also getting from the, the home screen, which is 21. And then the name being Kelvin. So, okay, so now when, let's let's test this out. So when you hit the details button, yes, yeah, so as you can see, we are, we are now seeing this is your details, name, Kelvin, so and then age, 21. So basically, this is how you can easily pass params from one screen to another. It's very simple. You simply add the params in the, in the first um, screen. And then you have it being navigated to the next screen or where you want to route it to great so this is where we are going to end this video if you've been able to learn something do not hit the like button and if you are new to this channel do what to subscribe as well as we are going to i'm going to be adding more content every week and be be logged in and be keep your hopes high and be waiting for these these videos turn on the post notification as well as since i'll be posting more videos very quickly okay so thanks for watching once again catch you in the next video